Hello. Today I'm going to talk about the business communication system. And there are written communication, oral communication, verbal communication, and nonverbal communication that is called and even visual communication. But today this is the topic of written communication. It is notice. Right? Notice. What is notice then? A notice is a piece of writing informing a large number of people about something. It may announce events or an issue or new development in the organization. It is clear and direct form of communication, usually placed in a prominent position within the workplace known as a notice board. Generally, it is placed in the notice board. Notices save time from having to send separate copies to many individuals. However, it is important to make sure that people are reading them. Without the reader's attention, without the audience read it, without the people of the organization, workers of the audience uh, give importance or notice to the notice, it does not function properly. So notice is to be read and known the information given to the staffs and the workers. So notice is generally given to the mass of the people for their information. Something is taking place or something is going wrong or some sort of events are being held or some sort of issues and new development of the organization can take place. This sort of information is generally given by the uh, head of the organization, executive dir directors of the uh, organizations, CEO, chief executives of the organizations, or anyone can give this set of notice to the public or to the workers in the organization. But notice can be of various types. They can be of different types. So one sample as an example of notices given below. I have even made a question and with the help of the question the notice is written. But before writing a notice a person must know what the question exactly is. If the question is not properly understood then naturally even the notice cannot be correct one. The question is write a notice about the exhibition of fruits production from the farmers of the country. The exhibition is taking place in Kathmandu. It is being conducted by the Fruit Collection and Distribution Private Limited. So all the farmers of Nepal are requested to be present with their fruits on 22nd April 2023 at 2 p.m. This is the question. So, uh, first of all, there should be topic here. Little bit uh, technical. Technically, it is not properly seen, but in the format, when we write in words, this is in slide. So there are these are the points. These points, these key arrows should not be there. Fruit collection and distribution, private limited. This should be in the center. In in this place, this should be written. This is the title. And where it is taking place? And Kathmandu, Nepal. This is what should be here in the center. Notice that should come below that center. And the date is there of 22nd April 2023. It also should be there. And fifth anniversary exhibition. And these all information should be there in the center and from the center down without these errors. Now, this is the information of the notice. It is informed to all the fruit producing farmers of Nepal to be present in the exhibition fair being held by Fruit Collection and Distribution Private Limited in Kathmandu on 22nd April 2023, served at 2 p.m. in the Central Exhibition Hall in Kathmandu Plaza. This is what the place is given there. It, it is in Kathmandu Plaza Exhibition Hall. It is time is also given 2 p.m. And it is in 22nd April 2023. And who are invited? All the farmers, fruit producing farmers. All the fruit producing farmers must bring 
their best fruits that they have produced and they are to be compulsorily with their identity card they must be there with the identity card as the fruit farmers from the local level of government they must have that sort of card otherwise people may sit may not be the correct people who have to come there in the fair the fair is going to take place under the supervision of agricultural ministry of nepal and the secretary of the office of agriculture the best farmers would be selected and awarded the prize uh, for the winners of the fair as first second and the third according it means first um, just farmers second winner first winner and third winner they would be pri prized and selected and they would be awarded this is what the information is given there so uh, who is writing this notice kamal prasad taman this should be there below and who is this kamal prasad taman executive officer and his mobile number is mobile phone is this one in food uh, collection and distribution private limited this is how we write a kind of notice this sort of notice is for the understanding with the question we need to prepare a notice so this notice is a kind of written communication and there are all the points this is a technical one this written a notice and memo now other written communication points are to be in the form of language only right and then perhaps it is all about the idea of notice uh, let's see uh, you can read it you can get this sample and then you can just and write your own ideas about notice. Thank you.